Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna be showing off some mods, new mods, that I think are very cool and very unique. Most of these have come in the last week. The Minecraft community just never stops. Never gives me a break. There's always something new going on and I can't keep up with it. The first thing, probably one of the most exciting things that I found is the Minecraft sphere generator. Now you might be saying, hey, we're in Minecraft. I don't see any spheres. I only see squares. And yes, it was never possible to have a sphere in Minecraft until now. We just need to summon a sphere and it, it, oh, oops. Well, as you can see, here's our first sphere. It is a dirt sphere and I did not mean to spawn it in the water. That's probably my fault. Can I delete? We can get inside the sphere. I'm, I don't really like this. This is like a sphere hot tub. Can't even see myself. Delete selected. Select. Oh, oh, yo. Delete selected. <gasps> Ooh, okay, we have functionality. This is awesome. If this is possible, I would like to have the sphere, you know, high up in the air so we can get a good look at it. Make sure it's a sphere, you know. We don't want irregular shapes coming out, throwing us an oddball. All right, so let's spawn the most basic sphere. 400 entities. Nothing crazy here. Let's select it. Ooh, it look good in here. This do be a sphere. Uh-oh, you can see the limitations coming. <laughs> Yeah. But if we look down at it, or even at its side, it looks fantastic. As you can see, this is pretty much made up of a bunch of different items. We can grow the sphere. As you can see, it's a bunch of grass blocks, if you can believe it. I didn't think it was possible either. But these are all little individual items that are making a perfect sphere. I don't know the math behind this, but this is very impressive. Oh, we can just keep holding it down. There may not be a limit to the sphere. This is the simulation that everyone's talking about. Oh, this is so weird. It looks like I'm in space. Are they still moving? Yes, they are. <laughs> there may not be a limit to the amount you can grow these spheres. This is going to be really interesting when we get bigger spheres, like the 1600 entity spheres. We also may experience a little bit of lag. I don't know how that's going to go. Compress sphere. We can move the sphere. I can push it in directions <laughs> and then change. I don't know what change means. I don't think it actually does anything. Oh, whoa, whoa. Did these get bigger? No, they didn't get big. I'm tripping. Ah, oh, they didn't do anything. If we go into spectator, we might be able to see how this actually works. Okay, we're in spectator. Oh, yes. As you can see, there is uh, huge grass blocks that are attached to these armor stands, and the armor stands are spawned in a circle. I don't even know. How did you figure this out? This is nuts. They even have offset. Like, the ones at the bottom are underneath, and then the ones at the top are still underneath, so th that's very strange. I like this. Oh, I have an idea. Maybe if I put a different block into the change. Oh, oh my God, I'm so smart. 1.17 blocks, copper block. Whoa, okay, I like this. I like this a lot. All right, let's delete this. Goodbye sphere. We need bigger sphere. I wanna go for the biggest sphere possible. We're going to spawn the biggest sphere possible. Oh my God, the lag, but you can see there's a lot more objects in this sphere than the last one. God, the, oh, the render distance needs to come down. Because, oh, it doesn't even help. There's so many armor stands that it's it's struggling. Okay, we have to select the sphere, and then we gotta change the sphere, and then we gotta grow it. This sphere can get so much bigger before it breaks apart. How much bigger can it get? Uh-oh, we're missing something. All right, this is, this is pretty much as big as it can get. Oh no, shrink. There we go. That's as big as it can get while consistently being a giant sphere. Let's see how many are actually here. Oh my goodness. This is like one of those collapsible balls. You ever see you ever see one of those? Whoa, dude. I don't like this. Oh my god, they're literally popping out of existence. Goodbye, sphere. Goodbye. <laughs> All right, I'm going to attempt to delete this. The frame rate instantly shoots back up. Well, that was a very awesome generator. Thank you so much for making that. More spheres should be in Minecraft. I know, it's a controversial topic. More sphere Minecraft. Another new Minecraft mod that I think is just fun is arrows that spawn TNT as they fly. <laughs> oh God, oh God. It's a lot more fun when you're in survival because you, know, you have that risk of, of death. <laughs> oh my god, it goes forever. I have to get an aerial view of this. This looks so cool. We're just covering mods that look very appealing today. That's what we're doing. Oh, look at that. That looks so cool. Let's get a distant shot. We got a low arc in TNT. <laughs> we need to set up a contraption that shoots these. I'm going to see if it's possible. If it's possible, then I'll get it done. Don't worry. Oh, 
Okay, well, we have this machine. We'll see if it's gonna work. Don't know if it's gonna work or not. Kind of scared to turn this on, but okay. Well, we're... Oh, there it goes. It's going and it looks awesome. I don't know what these TNT towers. Okay, I gotta turn it off. I gotta turn it off. I gotta turn it off. It's too much. Oh my God, someone stop it. Why are they still spawning TNT? What is going on? I, I, I have no idea what's happening. What have I done? Okay, I have this really overcomplicated design, but basically the loop is coming from this way. And we got over here a little comparator so that when both of these are on, then it will start so that I can get a good view of it. And if it works, then it will start shooting now. Okay, it worked. Oh, it's so beautiful. Wait a minute, hold on. Stop. What is this? Why does this keep happening? <laughs> Whatever, let's just keep going. You know, why not? We're, let's just lag the server. It, it looks really pretty. I can't deny that. It looks so good. Oh, it's happening again. The towers are happening again, aren't they? I knew it. All right, let's turn it off. This next one's pretty crazy. I don't know if you can guess it. Let me know if you can guess. Can you guess? Oh my God, I need night vision. There we go. Night vision. Ah, so much easier to see. Can you guess what terrain this is? <laughs> it's not the new caves and cliffs update. I can tell you that. So this is the nether generation, except it's in the overworld instead of the nether. And then the nether is going to be the overworld. But I think this is way more interesting. It looks so weird. This this definitely could be the Caves and Cliffs update. You would have me fooled. Why didn't they just do this forever ago? This looks great. Oh, it has such interesting terrain. I love it. Is this Deep Slate? Is this what Deep Slate looked like? Oh, what? It's an Amethyst Geode. This is such a cool mod. I love it. I love this mod. I'm really looking for a desert biome because I really want to punch the ceiling. You know, call me crazy, but I want to see that. that. That sounds like it would be really funny to watch okay we kind of have something wow that was anticlimactic i want i want a desert give me desert maybe they just don't spawn sand on the ceiling that would be uh i'd be pretty disappointed in that fact if that's the, how it is okay i found it i found the nether is just not a fun place to try and walk around as you can set as you can see imagine if there was desert caves like this though this would be next level the glacier biomes just don't look that much different i'm gonna be honest they, they kind of look the same except there's just stone above them now well i think the creator of this mod was just too smart because this is as close as we can get to making the sand fall like that that's that's it that's the whole thing yeah i know i'm pretty disappointed as well hey that was a big one hey check it out <laughs> Wow. Okay, apparently there's still like generated structures in this world. So I teleported myself to where the game said that there was a desert temple. So I'm looking for it right now. I don't know if it's even in here or not. I'm actually really confused. Where could it possibly be? I teleported to the exact spot. Where could it be? There has to be a temple right here, right? Like somewhere in here. I know we're gonna find it. Come on, we have to find it. There's just a stupid cave. Is it in here? No, it's not. This is probably the coolest desert generation that I have seen today. Look at that. We still got dungeons. Free loot. Free diamonds. Oh my God. What the heck? Is that diamonds? <laughs> There's diamonds in the ceiling. What? What? Bruh. All right, well, those were the three most interesting mods that I could find. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like on the video and subscribe. I will see you in the next one.